Emu farming is a popular and lucrative business model. Emus are large-sized poultry birds of retired group and have high economic value. They produce valuable eggs, meat, oil, skin and feathers. They can adopt themselves with almost all types of agroclimatic conditions. They can be raised in both extensive and semi-intensive farming systems. USA, Australia and China are the leading countries in emu farming. Starting emu farming is easy. But you must have to learn the basics of emu farming. Emu farming basic includes feeding, housing, breeding, care, diseases and nature of these birds. You also have to gain a proper idea about total investment and profit from emu farming business. I am describing shortly the step-by-step -step process of starting commercial emu farming. Hi friends, welcome to Discover Agriculture YouTube channel. If you're not yet subscribed to our channel, please subscribe now. Benefits of Emu Farming Emu meat is very healthy and tasty. It is lower in fat and cholesterol and higher in protein and energy. Emu products like eggs, meat, skin, oil and feathers have a high value in the market. Emus take less food and convert them to various types of valuable products. They can even survive by eating cost-saving foods. You can easily raise some emus in your farm with your other livestock animals and poultry birds. Diseases are less in emus and they can survive in almost all types of agroclimatic conditions. Emu farming business is very profitable and it can be a great source of income and employment for the unemployed people. Emu farming doesn't require high technical and management knowledge. You can easily raise emus if you learn the basics of emu farming. Starting emu farming. If you have land for setting up farm then you can easily set up commercial emu farm. I have described the step-by-step -step process below for setting up commercial emu farm. Farm location. Select a suitable land for setting up commercial emu farm. It would be better if you have a plot of land of your own. While selecting land for emu farm, consider some important factors. Considerable factors for starting emu farming business includes availability of fresh and clean water, good and nutritious food source, availability of cheap labor, medication facilities, transportation system, suitable market near the place etc. Be very careful about these factors during selecting the land. Chick management. A newly born emu chick weights around 370 to 450 grams which is about 67% of total egg weight. Although the exact weight of chicks depend on the size of eggs. Keep the chick inside the incubator for their first 2 to 3 days. This will help to proper drying and for quick absorption of the yolk. After that keep them in deep litter flow house. You can make the litter with paddy husk and cover new gunny bags or burlap over the litter. You can also set brood air of around 25 to 40 chicks and 4 square feet space as required per chick for their first 3 weeks. Keep the brooding temperature of 90 degrees Fahrenheit for the first 10 days and reduce to 85 degrees Fahrenheit till their 3 to 4 weeks of age. Proper temperature management play a very important role for rearing emu chicks. Under the brood air, keep sufficient number of feeder and water pots. To avoid string and jumping of chicks make a chick guard of at least 2.5 feet height. Keep a bulb inside the brood air shed burning all time. A 40 watt bulb is sufficient for covering 100 square feet area. Extend the brood air area of chicks after their 3 weeks of age by widening the chick guard circle. Feed the chick starter mash for about 14 weeks or until they reach about 10 kg body weight. Emu chick requires sufficient run space for proper growth and healthy life. So, ensure sufficient flow space and run space for the birds for better production. Generally, 30 by 40 square feet flow space is suitable for raising about 40 chicks. The flow must have to be free from dampness and easily drained. Always be very careful and never overcrowd the pen. Grower management. Emus are big sized bird. They need big sized waterers, feeders and large flow space. Keeping male and female birds is a good idea. So, identify sexes and keep them separately from each other. Make a good litter inside the house to manage a fresh and dry condition. You can use paddy husk for making litter. Feed the birds grow a mash for their 34 weeks of age or until they reach 25 kg body weight. Along with grow a mash add about 10% of greens. Provide them sufficient amount of food and fresh water according to their demand. In grower stage, providing 40 by 100 square feet space for 40 birds will be enough. The flow must have to be free from dampness with easy drainage facility. Never keep the chicks or grower with adult emus. Breeder management. Generally, emu birds become mature at their 18 to 24 months of age. For proper breeding purpose keep the male and female ratio as 1 is to 1. 2500 square feet flow space is required for every pair during mating. For inducing mating and privacy purpose you can provide trees and shrubs. Add more vitamins and minerals in their food and feed them before 3 to 4 weeks of breeding campaign. This will ensure better fertility and hatchability in birds. 
Generally an adult bird eat about 1 kg food daily. But during mating period food taking rate get reduced drastically. A female emu lays about 15 eggs during first year and this number gradually increase from the next year. They lay eggs for the first time at their one and half years of age. An egg weights around 475 grams to 650 grams. The eggs are like tough marble and are of greenish colored. Normally an emu egg take about 52 days incubation period for producing a chick. Proper temperature and moisture control management is very important for hatching emu eggs. However, proper care and management ensure good and healthy emu chicks. So, be very careful during the total emu breeding process. Feeding. Like other birds and animals emus also need nutritious and balanced diet for their proper growth and reproduction. Good and high quality foods also keep the bird healthy and diseases free. So, for profitable emu farming, you must have to feed your birds high quality and nutritious food according to their demand. Along with good and nutritious food provide them sufficient amount of clean and fresh water regularly. Care and management. Emus are very strong and live for long time. Mortality rate and other health problems are less in emus. Chicks and juveniles sometimes suffer by some health problems. They may suffer by coli infections, clostridial infections, intestinal obstruction, leg abnormalities, malnutrition and starvation. The main causes of these types of health problems are genetic disorders, improper handling, improper brooding or nutrition and stress. Emus also get infected by some other health problems and diseases like aspergillosis, ascarid infestations, candidiasis, coccidiosis, lice, rhinitis and salmonella. You can apply ivermectin for preventing internal and external worms. Vaccinate the birds timely for RD at the age of 1, 4, 8, 15 and 40 weeks by Mukteshwar strain gave better immunity. And always try to take good care of your birds. Marketing. Sell your emu products when they reach marketing age. Along with emu meat, skin, oil, feather you can also sell eggs, day old chicks, growing birds. Normally you can sell every chick at the rate of 4,000 to 5,000 Indian rupees and 15 month aged growing emu at 20,000 to 25,000 Indian rupees. First of all try your local market. You can also sell emu products in international market. Emu farming is absolutely a very profitable business. Visit some emu farm practically and then start emu farming business. Hope you like this video. Share this video with all your friends and don't forget to subscribe Discover Agriculture channel. Thank you for watching this video. Have a nice day.